I told you last time. It's time to do this. We've 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 needed this for a long, long time. It is it's time. It's time. You know what's happening today. Don't pretend you don't. Uh, if you're if you missed the last episode, or maybe the last couple episodes, maybe you don't know what's happening right now. But you should. We're we're about to and I don't know if I want to do it right here, I'm gonna be honest. I don't think I wanna do it right here. I think I want to move my entire chest collection system over here and build a new helipad area. What do you guys think? Yeah, I think we should. I think we should build a new helipad area or new hot air balloon area, as it were, because that's what that is mainly. Uh, it's for the hot air balloon. We're gonna park the hot air, hot air balloon right over here. For it. I was trying to find a place to put it, put it, put it down right here. That seems good. Uh, oh, also we gotta we gotta get our crab pots today. We're getting lots of keys. Uh, this is going pretty well. Uh, I think I want to do some colored chests though. How do I? Can I? Can I make them or do I have to? Do I have to find them? If I have to find them. I'm out. I'm out of colored chests. I think. Uh, I think we can paint them if we had paint, which I I probably have paint somewhere. I think for now, though, we'll just go with just the basic, just the basic chest, probably. Yeah, we'll just go with the basic chest. Um, I'll empty these out and then maybe swap these out later or use, like, use these, still use these for food, maybe. I think that'll be good. Uh, but we'll use just the square chest for everything else. All right, let's, let's go take up the, uh... The helipad stuff. I can't believe we're actually doing this. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, I didn't. I didn't think we were gonna be doing this anytime soon. But um, I've been telling you guys for a while. We've got to organize. We've got to get this done. We don't have a choice. Uh, I'm gonna be moving the hell. The whole. The whole hot air balloon area. We're gonna be moving it um, somewhere else. I don't know where yet. I didn't plan for this yet. I'm, I'm one step at a time here, guys. We're not. I'm not making like. 40 steps ahead plans, which I probably should be, but I'm not. So, uh, we're just gonna pull this up for now. I remember how this stuff works, so, uh, two wide, two in the middle, and six long. We need some more energy here. Alright, that is gone. We need some more hardwood flooring, hardwood path, whatever it's called. Uh, I've got all this, I mean, I've just got stuff everywhere. There's just junk everywhere. There's hardwood path right here, though, so that's good. Uh, let's put that one back in. Let's get all these put in. All right, we just need uh, about eight more hardwood path here, and that'll be good. I'm going to take this, and we're going to put it in one of these chests right here because we don't really use this furnace anymore. No need for it. Let's go over here. Yeah, I'm super excited to be doing this. This is this has been something we've we've been planning for a while, and it needs to be done. And I'm just I'm tired of waiting. We've got to get it done. Look at, I mean, look at how messy these are. There is stuff literally just scattered, right, in all these things. And I don't have any hardwood flooring anywhere, seriously. I thought I would have some somewhere, but apparently not. I think the biggest thing, too, is how do I want to organize this? I want to make it simple, but at the same time, I want to make it functional. So, I mean, maybe we do like floor and decorations and some. Also, I found this jackaroo hood somewhere. Uh, I think maybe from a jackaroo. Ooh, poor jackaroo. Uh, let's see, hardwood, hardwood, hardwood. I don't have any. I don't have any hardwood. I do have hardwood planks. What was I using these for? Hang on, let's go to the sign writing table. What was I using these for? Um, mangrove. Oh, it was for this. Yeah, it was for the item signs. Okay. Uh, and how many do I have? I have 28. And I have 28 crates. I don't, again, I don't know that we're going to use all these. I have no idea. Uh, oh, where's my measuring tape at? It's here somewhere. We need it because I need to see how far. Oh, we officially have 200 keys as well, guys. And we still haven't done our crab pots today. Uh, I have I have a measuring tape. I know I do because we, we had it over here with us. This is exactly why we should <laughs> why we should have labels, uh, which we're gonna do. I promise we're gonna do labels. Let me let me get all the crab pot stuff taken care of, and uh, get the stuff together. I need make some more hardwood flooring. We'll finish that up, and then we'll get started. 
I found it. I found the measuring tape. <laughs> I had to look everywhere for this thing. I was like, I don't know where it's at. I need to see how far out uh, this guy goes. Okay. And then this guy. All right, this one does much better. So let's take... Uh, oh, it's not empty. Oh, that's right. I had some stuff in there. Okay. Let's take that. And let's take this. Uh, we're going to leave this for our production area. And uh, not for the chest area. Because... I want to set this up slightly differently so that our chests are in a uh, reasonable place, I guess. I, I, I don't I don't know. Like, I just want to have more, um, more room to, uh, to work on things. So let's get this guy down first. Um, that is somewhat centered right there, actually. Right? Then we do the recycler right there next to it. And then we hit it with the measuring tape. Boom, look at that. Perfect. 12 by 12 right there, so we can go all the way around. We can make aisles of chest if we want to, uh, which I don't know that I want to do that. I'm going to be honest. It's going to be kind of cramped. Uh, but this guy definitely, right, he goes way out there, so no worries on that one. Uh, and then our advanced cooking table we'll put on the other side of this. should still be centered right here. It should be evenly faced here. So if we do this, that still should be centered. It should be two in the center there. Two in the center there, and then we got this little guy right here off to the side, but that's okay, because we're going to bring our sign writing table. I'm going to get all this stuff over. I should have just picked it all up. I don't know what I'm thinking. We're going to get our sign writing table first. There we go. We'll get our old crafting table. Um, yeah. I think that's... I think that'll do it. What was I going to leave? What, why am I leaving this... Oh, because these guys. These guys depend on this. That's right. So let's put this back down right here. Right? And then we'll take this. And we'll just move it over there out of the way. And then we'll pick up the charging stations. We'll put them down right here. Like so. There we go. Alright, so if we leave that next to the key things. Uh, as a matter of fact, I think I'm going to move these. Can we move these down one? Uh, I want to leave space for uh, extras, and I, I'm pretty sure if we hit that. Yeah, look how far out that is. That's, that's plenty. Um, I want to leave some extra space for the... And as a matter of fact, I could put this solar panel right in the middle over there, and it would still be fine, but I kind of like it right here. We're going to leave space for two more of these. Speaking of two more of these, let's see if we can find... Yeah, he's right over there. Let's go talk to Jimmy and see if we can buy another one of these. I got plenty of money on me. I actually found 359,000 dink in, in a random chest. I, I, don't, I don't even know why it's in there. Uh, anyway, let's go see Jimmy and see if we can get another one of those key machines. This might be the easiest place I've ever seen his his boat to get to right here. This is nice. You got some crocos floating around. That's all right. Uh, key machine. Key cycler. Yes, sir. 700,000. I'll take it. Um, can only get one at a time. That's all right, though. I'll, I'll take what I can get. Ruby shard, bl blueprint. That's a random blueprint, right? Like, I don't, I don't know if I want to waste the money. It's 400,000 on a random blueprint. Maybe, maybe not today. Maybe not today. All right. The worst part about this is going to be moving all of my stuff from one to another. I really should just use the chest I've already got, but I like the idea of starting fresh here. All right, so we don't need the basic crafting table, so we're going to stick it over here out of the way. Uh, yeah, right there looks good. Okay. We do need the sign writing table over here. Our repair station's right there, so let's do the sign writing table like that. Get a repair station. I'm trying to make a whole little... I, so this is something I've never... Like, everything's always just been kind of randomly placed down wherever. Oh, this is our key cycler. Yeah, we need to put this over here. The rest of the keys. Uh, and I think we'll wait to put anything in it. That way they're all timed correctly. There we go. We have four of those bad boys now. Sweet. Yeah, this is going to be the worst part, I think, is just moving, getting all the material in one place. It's going to take quite a while, I think. It's going to take quite a while. Let's get all this out of the way. We're going to leave a walkway right in the... I'm not sure why we have our, uh, our truck still up on jacks, but uh, something apparently went wrong somewhere. Okay, so let me, let me do this. Let's, let's start like this. And then put a sign. We can't put a sign behind it, so we have to come in one. 
Um, yeah, let's do this then, right? If we've got to go behind it with the sign. Let's do one of those. And let's actually take the corner one out completely, maybe? I don't know. This is, this is probably more chest than I have over there anyway. If I do like this. I'll just do like a nice little horseshoe. Um, and we leave the corner ones on this side. I think that's more than we had over there to start with. So we can probably do a lot more, and I've got two left. Which would be those corners, right? Let's, let's put them... Man, I don't, I don't really know where to put them. I don't want to put them right here. That seems cramped. Put one right there. And this will be like my tool case, right? If I'm going to the mines or whatever, I can drop all my... My unneeded, like I'm going to the, the first layer, I can drop my chainsaw in there. You get what I'm saying, right? I'll put all my tools in there. I don't have a place for my tools right now, so it only makes sense to do. But I think this will let me, even my random chest I've got over there for my um, orchard or whatever, it'll let me put all of my random stuff in here. I, I think, anyway. Uh, stuff like extra crates, right? Sign writing tool. The hand trolley. Stuff like that goes in here, right? I think that's a pretty good, efficient way to do this. Alright, so let's go like so. I hate that I hate that it's not like I hate that it takes up one whole square. Okay, I don't know. I can walk. Yeah, I can't walk in there. Alright, so we're just gonna do one of those. Alright, then we're gonna spin this one around. Oh, we put signs in there somehow. How do I take those out? Did I accidentally put signs in my... In my how did I put an axe in? I don't even have an axe. Take these back out, I guess. All right, let's try this again without adding 14 different things to it. There we go. Whoops. I didn't realize I was inserting the items into the sign itself. Um, and, and I think that's going to be easier than using the sign writing tool, I'm going to be honest. Uh, it's probably going to be easier to do it this way. Oh, we got a sign up here, too. Do I have another? Uh, yep, I was about to say, I should have two left over, because I did have two crates uh, left over as well, and I had the same amount of signs. I don't know where it went. <laughs> I'm running around trying to pick it up. I don't see it, though. Yeah, I don't see it anywhere. All right, well, whatever. Uh, we have one sign left over somehow. I don't know. Oh, uh, we had one crate left over as well, because we put... The extra crate right here. And that left us with one and one. Yep. All right. No, that's still wrong because that's two crates. There's one in there and there's one there, but I don't have a... Oh, I see what I did. I see it. Okay, so I guess technically I could put the corner crates down. Now, I like this idea of having this for like all of this extra stuff, right? That's good. All right. So I think what we're going to do is I'm going to do like desert, right? So we're going to do... Uh, let's put desert stuff back here, maybe. Boom. Okay. That is the jackaroo paw. I think I want to use the cactus fig, though. Yeah, we'll use the cactus fig uh, to show desert stuff. Right? So all the stuff you pick up in the desert. Uh, Spinifex resin maybe goes in craftables, and maybe we put craftables right here at the beginning. Or right here. Maybe right here. Uh, so let's put these in here. And this will be all of our stuff like... Um, this will be all of our stuff like uh, ore, that kind of thing, right? That's that's what this is going to be. Uh, advanced cooking table. Yeah, that works. Alright, sweet. Uh, let's put our measuring tape in here. I do like the fact that we can... So, I didn't realize this until just... I'm not going to lie. I didn't know this until just now. We can just click, and then we can measure. So, anytime we're trying to figure out like exact numbers on something, we can just, we can just use this. That's so much nicer. So much nicer. I wish I'd have known that before. All right, let's go start moving things. Let me drop all of my weapons and stuff in my my tool chest here. Drop all that in there. Oh, my inventory completely empty here. So I can move. Oh, you know what I do need, though? I think moving the, uh, the chest with the trolley to start with. So everything but the trolley. Moving them with the trolley to start with is probably going to be easier. This is a long move. Uh, I'm going to move a bunch of chests over here to start with, and then we'll we'll start uh, going through things. Oh, it's pixel paper. I had to I had to stop my recording uh, where we were, <laughs> so I'm picking back up now on a new day because it only saves when you sleep. Uh, so 
yeah, this is wood stuffs. It looks like we got desert stuffs over there. Uh, again, moving the stuff one at a time is definitely going to be a thing. Uh, it is pixel paper day here on the island. And uh, let's see, this is just wood stuffs, right? So let's go gum nut. Yeah, we're going to leave all that stuff in there. Let's go like this. Let's, let's use one of these. There we go. Open. All right, let's go. What is this? Gumwood? Yep, gumwood first. Go gumwood logs, gumwood planks. Uh, I don't have any palm wood logs, so we'll do that. Let's do hardwood, hardwood planks. And then we'll do mangrove, and then we'll do bottle tree wood over here, even though I can't make anything out of bottle tree wood. And then we got gum nuts. So we got gum log, gum plank, gum nuts. Uh, and then mangrove sticks at the bottom. Just, I mean, we, I guess we can put them up here because there's only one other type of tree, I think. There we go. And then we got uh, stuff like wattle flowers. Um, this is where it's going to get tricky. A lot of this stuff may end up kind of in the same place, like catch-all stuff. Uh, let's get, let's just get all the, Oh, my keys are in here too. I forgot about that. All right, let's go. Let's put the crab pots in here. A lot of this is going to be kind of figuring out where I want things, honestly. So a lot may be skipped here. Okay, so here's what, I've, here's what I'm doing so far. This is what I'm thinking. Uh, keys in here, and then my plates in here for my keys, right? I'm going to put those back in my inventory. Uh, seaweed, so sea stuff here, desert stuff over there. Um, we got stuff like mushrooms, wattle flower, stuff like that. And this one, wood here, we're going to go ore, seeds, um, and then flower type stuff, right? Uh, or not flower type stuff, but like collectible type stuff. And then actual flowers, we'll put in this one, so like these guys over here, right? All right, let's just use these for an example. All right, put those there. Wait, did that just duplicate? Did I pick up two? I don't know if I picked up two or not. But yeah, we'll do like that, right? And then uh, we'll figure out the rest of it as we go. Let's go grab another crate. It is pixel paper day, so at some point we're going to have to go over to the gazebo. That thing, whatever that thing's called. The gazebo. Oh, you know what we need to do? Hang on. I really, I really need my slate over here, too. I forgot about them. Uh, when you get some more keys going, we'll go put them in there in a second. All right, so these are seashells. So next to the sea items, right? This will probably be a good spot for them. Next to the sea items, we'll do seashells. Uh, and we can go back and paint these, I think, afterwards. I don't think we have to paint them right this second. I think we can paint the, the crates. I would rather use the chest because the chests look kind of cool, but uh, I think we're just going to go back with crates just because. One, I didn't have any more chests. This is what I had, so. All right, so here we have... Uh, all the stuff we get out of the, um, except for those, all the stuff we get out of the containers and whatnot, we'll do those, right? And then we got like this, the advanced stuff, meteorite junk. So we'll do like rare items. Uh, so this is this, right? Yep. So that's uh, spin effects resin. That's crafting things. And, and this kind of classifies as crafting things as well. So let's do like this. These kind of classify that way. We're going to do one of those. Oh, they do. Oh, it doesn't actually take the item away to put it in the sign. Okay, cool. Uh, and then over here on this one, I think we'll do something like this, where we'll tell it that you know this is like uh, f farming type stuff, or maybe just um, catch all for that kind of thing. And then here uh, will be like weapons and whatnot, right? So there we go. It was trying to shoot, uh, and then we got like a spot for rares somewhere, right? So if we go over here. We do like rare items, this meteorite chunk, for instance. I, I consider that a rare item because it's kind of rare. Now we could actually write on these signs, but I actually like the images. I actually like the way they look. It looks pretty good. All right, so all of these are empty. Next, yeah, we're gonna try to sort some of this, uh, the building material over here too, uh, where it's not just like, like this, right? Like. Uh, we got an animal trap in here. We got some more farming stuff, which again, this goes with watering. So we're going to move that. The fencing things will probably go by themselves. Uh, maybe like fencing and uh, fencing and maybe bridges. No, should we do bridges? Let's do bridges by themselves. I've got plenty of chests here, I do believe. Let's, oh, nope. That's not what I wanted to do. There we go. Oh, it tried to put it down when I put it in the side. I see. Okay, so bridges there. Then we go over here. We got that in there. So we'll go like this. And then we got... Um, uh, let's, let's put, let's put animal traps like right next to that, I guess. 
So it would be stuff like this. Right? And then we could do flooring. Uh, we got bridges, fencing. What else do we have as far as building stuff? Fencing, flooring, right? Yeah, let's do um, let's do flooring here. There we go. And then this one's empty. All right, so we got more flooring. We got more fencing. We got archways, which I think we'll go with the fencing because it'll it'll do better there probably. All right, so we got that. Then we'll pick this up. All right, let's go down here to fencing first. So we got all this fencing in here, which is. I mean, it's good to have all this, but it's a lot its a lot of spare extra stuff. But at least now I know I can walk over, see the fencing, grab it, go. Uh, we got stairs. I forgot about stairs. Do we put stairs in its own category too? I think we do. I think we do. I think it's just time, guys. I think we just, I think we just do it. All right, we got one more thing of fencing there. Let's put stairs in their own category. Actually, let's not use this. Let's use, uh, no, the background's white. Let's use those. Yeah, I think that works. All right, so let's go like that. Uh, and then we got like flower bed stuff, right? So let's go over here. And we'll do that. Boom, there we go. All right, now we're getting down to just the basics here. This should be like seeds, which I, I think we had a place for them. I just don't have them labeled yet. What did I do? I did uh, the wood or seeds. Is that right? I think that's right. Uh, oh no, this is still fencing and and flowering and that kind of stuff. And then we got what is this thing? Rain coral. So that'll go with the ocean stuff. Water beds will technically go with flooring because it just makes sense. So uh, let's just put them at the bottom there. And then we got uh, some more flooring there. Uh, fencing gates, same thing. Uh, the potato box. We're gonna have like um, a decorative box here in a minute. We'll have that for that too. So there we go. There's that one. Then we got a bridge, right? And then we got like seats and benches. I think probably should have its own too. So uh, I know this is probably a lot, but at the same time, it's not really because it's all gonna need its own place. So it'll be much easier to find what we're looking for when we when we need it. All right, this should be seats. Thank you guys so much for tuning in to part one. Uh, leave a comment, like, subscribe, all that kind of stuff down below. I appreciate you. Part two next Sunday of the organizational um, episodes. See you then. Later, folks. <laughs>